Hi, I'm Milena Moser. I'm a writer from Switzerland, and I'm here to share some of my insights with you. I'm using these Barbie dolls who usually sit on my desk to um, talk about outside voices. There's a whole story about me and Barbie dolls, but that's, <laughs> that's for some other time. Okay, outside voices. I get so many letters of people sending me their writing, asking me, could you please read that? Could you please tell me if it is worth pursuing? And it breaks my heart, but I can't do that because it wouldn't mean anything. It doesn't mean a thing. Even if I told you this is the best writing I have ever read in my entire life, it would not mean a thing. It would not mean, yes, you'll be successful, you'll be published, you'll be loved. No. It's if you, ah, oh, this is hard to say, but if you need someone to tell you that you're a writer, then you're probably not a writer. If you need someone to tell you that you should be writing, you shouldn't. I'm sorry. You have to find something in the act of writing itself that tells you, this is what I'm meant to do. This is when I'm most myself when I'm writing. Okay? So there is a point where you need outside feedback. But I would say the third draft is the one that you should show people. And by that time, you should be at a point where you don't need reassurance, but you need challenge. You're waiting for those first readers to tell you what they think and not just, oh, this is great. And the interesting thing is that if you ask two people at the same time, they will give you completely contradictory feedback. And that is great because the feedback doesn't mean you have to, you have to change your story necessarily. Maybe you do, maybe you don't. But the feedback challenges you to look at your story in a different way, in a way that you can't anymore. After a year, two years, you don't know. You get lost in the details. So you need two people you trust to tell you what they think and then you think about your story again in a different way. I know there's much more to say about that and I will. And I will tell you the story about me and Barbie dolls.